The next drill is going to be a little more challenging. I showed it to you when we were doing the throwing drills, but now we're going to actually do it with a hitter. And it's that tap, tap, hit drill instead of the tap, tap, throw. What we're going to have her do is we're going to try to isolate her legs so that we keep the weight on the inside of the feet. Okay, again, trying to establish a good foundation, a good base, establish some rhythm. There's a lot of good things that can happen out of this drill. So we're going to begin by having Andrea go six times and then hit. So she's going to go tap, 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 and hit. That's a really nice job right there. Just make sure you stay on the inside of those feet. One, two, three, four, five, hit. Yep. One, two. Good. And then we'll have her go to four taps and hit. Again, learning a little body control, a little timing, a little rhythm. And then we'll have her go to two and hit. But the thing we want to see here is that they're using the inside of their feet. They have some flexion in their legs, and they're able to generate some force as they go to toe touch. A lot of young hitters will sit there and do this. Well, this doesn't do anything. We want to make sure that they're in their legs. There's some flexion there, and they're able to generate some power by establishing a good foundation. Very nice. Good job right there.